I was glad that uh, Nancy Lindenborg of USAID and Ambassador Robert Ford and I could come today to this camp in Turkey. Frankly, it's a very well-run, well-organized, well-resourced camp. I come away very impressed by the way the Turkish government has provided so much to the Syrian refugees. Many of the Syrians with whom I spoke today are very grateful to the government of Turkey, to the people of Turkey. That's the good news piece of the story. And so I was very happy to see children who are well-fed, who are be being kept warm and are in a safe place. We are working to ensure that if more people come out of Syria, they will also get a reception like this. We are supporting the UN High Commissioner for Refugees. USAID is working with the World Food Program. So we want to continue the ability to, for, for refugees to cross open borders and get the help they need. But they're not alone. They are supported by the United States and that American um, funding is coming through international organizations and to reach them and to help them and to help their compatriots. We need more countries to step forward and, and also help. That's, that's really the goals of the Kuwait Pledging Conference.